Welcome back. I understand we have unknown hostiles expecting our package. MI5 has identified several possible points of entry. Be advised, the nature of the cargo is currently unknown. Roger. My team is making ready. We'll be on plot within the hour. Don't worry, man. Whoever they're Don't take any shipments from UPS guys with beards and funny accents. <laughs> That's my rule of thumb. There you go. Oh, really? Can you shoot it? Are those bad guys? Hey, Wallcroft is back. We haven't seen him since the boat. Yep. Okay. Now you here, you know base play. Yeah. We know, I know who base play is. He's evil. I'm not saying anything. It's actually, it's actually General Shepard. He's not dead! <laughs> yeah, that, uh, the bullets, the, the knife to the eye didn't really kill him. He just played dead, and then when he woke up later, he just pulled it out, and his eyeball came out. Now he has a cool eye patch. And we are Sergeant Burns. He has the same voice as, um... Sounds like a ghost. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Who sounds like Gaz? Ooh, a P90 suppressed, or should I have my? Uh, I'll take the P90 suppressed. And this hiccups, is and hiccups this is, on the side. And this is in London. Yep. What the hell kind of freaking place in London can guys just walk around with freaking guns? These buildings remind me... West End? <laughs> you know what these buildings remind me of, though? Uh, fear. Yes. <laughs> like, at any moment, we could just have some kind of mech warrior thing come walking out, or some ghostly fuck-up will mess with our head. Or we'll have to find some obscure way to climb some boxes to get through a hole that we didn't see. Mm -hmm. Watching soccer in slow motion. Yes, destroy them, or else all the British operatives will get distracted by riding in the streets. Yes. Especially if it's Manchester United versus um, Arsenal. Yeah. What? Are those good guys or bad guys? Bad guys. The guy, bad guys launched the rocket. Or did yes. you launch the rocket? They launched it. But I thought you wanted to destroy the car. No. We want to see what's inside of it. Can't we just agree it's something bad and blow it up? We could, but we there were also a bunch of other uh, trucks that left as well. And if we don't know what was inside of them... Come on, Wallcroft! Jesus, I think they could have made a fire any possibly faster. They're just gonna. The next game is just gonna be a laser. It'll just go, and that'll be an entire magazine. Okay. Open truck door. Where the hell did these Russians come from? Did they have like a freaking resistance army hidden somewhere in Britain? Maybe. I love that little itty bitty news helicopter that they equipped with a machine gun. Pew. <laughs> All but one. You will not escape. Well, you got that right. Oh. Wow. You hit me, you jerk.
<laughs> Reginald, sort out those... Sort out those mini-muggins on the catwalk, would you? I dare say they're giving me quite a frumping. To wit. Ah, yes. You've destroyed them. That's the dog's bollocks. I like how it was tracking on Wallcroft as if it knows that I'm going to kill him at some point. His name is actually Wallcroftski. <laughs> and he pulls off this little thing and underneath it is a beard. You should have known. <laughs> the beard. Never trust the beard. Because we know what happens when you combine beards and foreign accents. It can only be evil. Of course. Just look at the Death Star. He was full of British people. Liam Neeson in Batman Begins. He was evil. But not in Star Wars. And he did have a beard. But he also had the long hair. He was like a British... British Look, Jedi. he's having trouble lifting an umbrella. <laughs> Kill him in the porta potty. How I funny need... would that be if some guy just flops out? <laughs> like some construction worker was in there all day with the craps. <laughs> oh, I need to get home. <laughs> all these kids are setting off the firecrackers outside. I don't know. Unscrew. But in Britain, that's the port side. Did you really just gun down a dock worker? That's what they're all do. That's what they all are, though. They're all dock workers. Really? Maybe they shouldn't have trusted the not evil Russian dock workers union army. <laughs> Maybe they thought, oh well, this firearms training is just in case of a, a terrorist attack. And all the guns and evil beards. Those are just for show. <laughs> to scare off the union world. rules. What it, what is what does that say on that sign there? Porto Porter Potty. Five 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 dump. <laughs> I've seen a, a septic tank cleaner, uh, the trucks that they use, yeah. on the back it says, and you think your job sucks. <laughs> you think your job is shitty. See how safe this is? Driving. Oh. Duck! Thwack! Takes your head off. Shouldn't he be driving on the other side of the railway tunnel? There we go. They're all wearing like bright orange James Bond henchman coveralls. Yeah. <laughs> As if to say, shoot me first. The truck's freaking out running the train. Oh goodness, the train, it's late! What happens if you shoot the civilians? You fail. Oh. I thought after the whole airport level, we were totally over innocent civilians. Not really. None of the passengers are wondering why a news helicopter armed with a minigun is shooting at a railway car full of dock workers. <laughs> it's the dock workers' strike. Use that armor-piercing round. Throw a stick on the rail. <laughs> Put a penny on the rail. It'll derail. A 
and now another useless character dies. I feel like the freaking aluminum bodied rail car would not take out that many bridge supports. I didn't know it would have that much energy. It must have been traveling at 40 kilometers an hour. At least. And now Mac Rob appears magically and shoots you in the face again. Every single time one of your guys goes down, here comes Mac Rob. <laughs> you could be at like your freaking Thanksgiving dinner. You trip and fall and drop the turkey and Mac Rob is right there to shoot you in the face. <laughs> wow, I like how it said saving. <laughs> it said saving on the screen. That is ridiculous. There he is, shoot him! It's Walcroft. You really need to hear this guy freaking panting the whole time. Oh, now I'm better. Wait, I want to see what the movies say. Kill these guys. This is the gang. <laughs> but soon you will know. What else? Dregs coffee. Be bold. What do the signs over here say? Special forces. Hey! You're trying to read here, you jerks. Okay. <laughs> Raphael. <laughs> Tower funds investments, it's time to what? Aw. Like how that guy, the guy's wearing like a, looks like something from freaking Ghostbusters, don't he? Just read the signs and satiate my curiosity. Deeper, an exhilarating adventure into the unknown. It's time to invest. Br bleak. What does that say? That's You're never alone? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> they all have two faces and three hairstyles between them. Ooh, is that a P99? Oh, it's a 57. Where are they all coming from? Where's my guy? Where's he, my teammate? I think he died. Oh, nope, there he is. Don't let the guy in last stand freaking kill you. Or I'll be forced to kill you. Time! The world stands on the brink. Interpol's most wanted. Hey, there we are. Well, there's soap in uh, price anyway. No, the Cinnabon's closed on Sunday. Didn't we kill you already? I thought we did. But clearly not. These are long levels, by the way. Apparently. You have no ammo in that gun, you moron. <laughs> the escalator, it's dragging you towards the grenade. Watch this, watch this. Ooh, what are the magazines? Swamp fishing. Tran Transgalactic. Particle physics. Ooh, how many people subscribe to that, I wonder. I'll just take the PM. <laughs> I want a Mars bar. You see, all you see is one poor Russian trying to run up the down escalator. <laughs> hey! You can't jump the fair. You have to pay 20 pence. Oh. Oh, <laughs> I shot the guy, sorry. Yeah, that's kill right. Kill him, kill him. Shoot, shoot the Russians. <laughs> <laughs> I 
If you they, kill, if sweet, you they actually react. That's pretty cool. Oh. I mean, we took him prisoner, but totally executing prisoners. That's totally oh, okay. We're going to intercept a truck. Don't tell me Manchester United lost, and that's why all these police are here. Empty. Uh oh. Uh oh. Davis family vacation. Really? Really? This. Oh my God. Are you serious? We're gonna have to watch a little girl and her family melt. Boom. No. What? It's not moving. She gets hit by a truck. No. A nuclear weapon goes off. She gets kidnapped. Are you fucking shitting me? Really? As if gunning down a fucking, uh... As if gunning down a fucking airport full of people wasn't enough, you gotta gas a little girl on her vacation. At 622 Greenwich Mean Time, chemical attacks were triggered across Europe. I repeat, down the streets within the contamination radius. It's being called the worst terror event in history. This is the idea needs you. My men are dead or dying. I've been exposed. Roger, we are aware of the gas attack and are sending decon units. You know what it away. is. Not the gas. We're under attack by Russian ground forces. Say again, Ramstein. What Russian forces? The entire Russian army. Request immediate assistance. Our witnesses are now reporting Russian tanks rolling down the Champs Elysees. This was no act of terrorism. The attacks were intended to cripple our defenses and you know what gas it was, right? mm -hmm. Sarah? Nova 6! <laughs> Clark! <laughs> he came back from the future to kill us all. <laughs> oh god. The vice president. The vice president? Yeah, we gotta save his ass. Oh, we already fucked up the president. <laughs> well, no, the United States. Well, what's the, wrong president with... was, the president was from Russia. Well, then why are we saving the vice president? Why can't we be saving the president, president? Regardless, we have to cut off now. We'll see you guys next time. This is TMFTP, signing, signing out. out.